hear it in his voice how, ha how happy he was to be home. Daniel Ferguson's first phone call with his cousin Bobby since his release from federal prison after eight years behind bars. Judge Nancy Edmonds granting the former contractor and friend of former Mayor Kwame Kilpatrick a compassionate release because of health concerns due to COVID and the release of Kilpatrick, his co-defendant, back in January. We shared a moment where when you realize, like, man, I'm actually free. And he's like, you know that feeling, cuz. So. I mean, it's just a great film. Daniel Ferguson says he spent about the same amount of time behind bars as his cousin, so he has a unique perspective on just what Bobby is going through. I know him having sat down this time for eight years, he has a newfound look on things. He's, he's definitely going to see things differently. And it's going to be interesting to see what he decides to do. Ferguson's attorney, Mike Ratai, wouldn't speculate, but said his client is very religious and mentored other inmates while behind bars. I've gotten a lot of questions, you know, what's Bobby going to do next and all this other stuff. Well, I mean, for God's sakes, the man's been out less than 24 hours, right? So, I mean, he needs to decompress. He needs to spend time with his wife and his children and his grandchildren that he's now, you know, meeting for the first time. Five new grandchildren he can finally hug. Ratai and his team say justice has now been served. The U.S. attorney objected to Ferguson's release, but Ratai says his sentence of 21 years for conspiracy, bribery and extortion was far longer than normal. Average sentence for those crimes is 32 months. Ferguson will be under supervised release for three years and has been ordered to pay $6 million in restitution to the city. But for now, he's home with his family for the first time in eight years. We're grateful, we're ecstatic, and uh, as far as we're concerned, justice prevailed. He's getting to see his grandchildren grow now, and, and it's going to be a beautiful thing. It's just a, a good feeling to be able to be with your family. I know how I felt when I got home, so I, and I know how he's feeling. In Detroit, Amy Lang, Fox 2 News.